Hey guys, today we're playing Road to Guangdong. There it goes. This is gonna be a road trip game. Be a change of pace. Something different for today. Guma. I'm really sorry I was late. Do you think Guma has nothing better to do than to wait for you? Shall I drive? You make me wait and you want me to be the driver? Sorry, I'll drive. Of course. Yes, I think your Guma deserves to rest her, her feet. Yes, of course. Sorry I was late. There was a delay with the trains. In our day, we used to allow time for delays and other things. We never made our elders wait. Oh, she's pleasant. Sorry, Guma. It won't happen again. It better not. Guma is cross. Uh... Can I click on that? Why are you so angry? I can react to that specifically. Boom, let's press her. Are you angry, Guma? I had already apologized. How many times do I need to apologize? I, uh... Never mind. What is it then? Is there something that's annoying you? You are annoying me. Just drive. Please tell me, Guma. I, uh... I think it's supposed to be... I, uh... I, unless that's her name. Guma's just tired. I don't know what I'm doing at the restaurant, Guma. I really need your help. Yes, you do. Guma has been managing the restaurant since Gong Gong opened it. That's why I need you. You're the only one who knows everything. Hmm. <laughs> at least you know that. Come, Guma. Without Baba and Mama around, you're, you're stuck with me. Hmm. I want to learn from you, and I'll work hard, I promise. You better. Now let's not waste more time. Let's go. Yes, let's go. Who are we visiting first? Let's go visit Sum Sok first. He's in Foshan. Do you remember his Kung Fu High School? Wow, yes, I used to spend my summers training with him. Can't see the text past the saving game icon. <laughs> it's an unfortunate choice. Third engine. Left bumper. Alright. So right trigger is gas. Left trigger is reduced speed. Be a little careful here. Can I look around in here? A little bit. Not much. I can't look next to me to see where Guma is. This is pretty. Doesn't feel like I'm going that f Oh, it's probably 60 kilometers, right? That's what? Closer to 40, hour, 40 miles per hour? There's been an ongoing subgenre of, of indie games where you first person drive through an area kind of linearly until. St They're even, not only are they floating, they're above the road. Was that a gl- You arrive at garage. I can't tell if that was a glitch or if that's where the game's gonna start going. Is getting really weird like that. Whoa. I hope Sandy's alright. She's getting old. Ayah, Guma's older, but you don't see me complaining. 
Don't forget to fill up the petrol and oil before we leave here. I think it was... I think it was Errant Signal that made a channel, uh, a video that was just about, like, the subset of indie first-person driving things where the... The, the driving mechanically is ne not necessarily the entire point. It's part of why I played a Paratopic for, uh... For the Halloween event. Don't waste money. Hi, welcome to Jayao Garage. What can I do for you? We need petrol and oil. No problem. Come to the pump. We'll fill the car and put in the oil for you. Doesn't cost extra. Alright, bye. Oh. How much do I buy? Oh, you just press fill here? Okay. So we have this on us already? So we have 15 petrol and, and 4 oil just on us. Did I buy more? Just in case? Hopefully we'll be fine. Done. Thanks for buying local. N nothing, sorry. Okay, bye then. Let's go, Sandy. Why do you like take talking to the car? There's a mouse in the middle of the screen now. I don't know if... Th that wasn't there before, was it? The scrap heap? Sandy is old. She'll prefer older parts. Mm, what a treasure trove of car parts. Shall I check the scrap? Of course, it could save us a lot of money. They all seem to have a lot of... A lot of health. Take a fan belt? Oh, the stuff on the rice is what I already have. Is there a limitation in this game? Or am I just... Boom, two engines. We have two scrap engines. Look at us being badass. They're apparently free. That should save some money. Are you ready? Are you asking me or the car? Wow. We're gonna get along great. Are we going now? Yes. It does say generating. Maybe the drive's supposed to look different every time. And maybe that... What we saw there was the game glitching out. So to be clear, I'm playing this in May. This game's supposed to come out in like June or something. So I am getting... This is pre-release. So there may be some bugs that won't be there at release perhaps. Oh, my oil's... Uh oh. We're out of oil. I thought I just refilled the oil. Did I miss something back there? Let's check the car. What? Oh, this is something. Okay. An eye-pleasing and aerodynamic cover for the car's engine and associated mechanical systems. Bloop. Oil. Refill. There we go. Uh, I think I, I, th I think I overspent. I think I somehow managed to spend a one oil and a five oil, but it only carries four. Perhaps. Okay. Well, then we should be good now. I hope. 
Get off the screen, mouse. Seems to be loading screens that brings it back. There we go, we've got oil now. Our temperature's good. Our, our fuel looks like it's good. Uh, and the far right panel has exposed wires because whatever that is is just gone now. Hope that wasn't too important. What? We're out of oil again? So we're leaking. We're definitely leaking. Crap. I should have probably left. I probably should have had this checked more. They were like, don't spend money. Okay. Oil filter. Replace. I didn't realize the first time around that it was draining so quickly. Good thing there's a bunch of nice opportunities to highlight something and then it's all like, that's what that is, because I still have not got particularly good with cars. I'm out of oil. Yep. Yeah. Because we sp we threw it all out. We threw all of the oil out on the road. Well, now the oil filter's fixed. Hopefully, I can reach my destination before the oil runs out, and we'll buy more. I'm good at car. This is really pleasant. It's hard to explain because not ton a ton going on right now, but this is just like. An audio-visual experience I wasn't expecting to have today. Partly because I didn't pre-plan what I was going to record. But, uh... There's a certain appeal... ...of how games can just do that. Just go into a completely different place. Go have a road trip in, in a... ...colorful... ...pretty version of a fictionalized version of a... ...foreign country. Oh! It's getting late. Late enough that our lights are coming on. So oil does last. That was just on me. Wow. Maybe I should have bought way more gas too. We're running out of gas now. This car is a piece of garbage. What do you call? What'd you call it, Sandra? Sandra's garbage. It's a good thing there's no other cars on the road or we'd get hit when we keep stopping constantly. The oil's lasting now. Oh, here we go. There we go. Anything else? Can you open the trunk or other places? Sort of getting the hang of the controls here. Go away, mouse. So our gas is good, our oil's bad again. But it's it's been bad since we had to refill. I really do just have to hope we can make it. Or <laughs> I'll suffer the consequences. Watch me not even make it to the first destination because I didn't get enough oil. It's the dark souls of road trip games. It really makes you feel like you're out of gas. I hope I didn't miss my exit.
Theoretically, I don't even have to stay between my lanes, but I am. Come on, oil. You can make it. That's concerning. Why am I running out of gas? Whoa. So you can you you can escape. If you if you do run out of resources, you can get help. But it's not great. It's expensive. You suffer the consequences. What's that? No, my wheels are fine. Oil's not great, but I don't think I can do anything about that. Yeah. Better get more of those soon. The oil filter's fine. Engine's fine. Just trying to think if there's anything in here that might relate to me having uh, gas mileage problems at all. Oh, look at that color scheme. I always like it when a, when a game lets me spend time with the yellow or like the yellow orange and purple contrast. It's so it's so calming. I'm going to run out of oil despite my best efforts. Uh-oh. Come on. Come on. This is a long commute to go visit whoever. Long enough that we're changing day-night cycle and running out of gas multiple times. And they said they talked about who we're visiting first. This is a big road trip we have planned here. Yay, we made it to Foshan. Haha, -ha, I'm not a failure. Ah, good feet. Feels good to stretch my legs. Nice journey. I really enjoyed that drive. Yaguma's old. You don't need to remind me. I. That's not what I was going for, but okay. Should we take more breaks? I, uh, just go and knock on the door. Hello? I'm here to see my uncle. We're here to see Kevin Tong. Peace be with you. Huh? She closed the door on us. Go knock again. Tell them who we are. I'll make sure your sum sok hears about this. Yes? We're here to see Master Tong. Can I help you? He's busy with a class. He's expecting us. He's expecting our arrival. Can you tell... Uh, can you let him know we're here? And who are you? I'm Sunny, his niece, and this is Guma. Ah, why didn't you say so? Will you shut the door in our face like a dick? Please come with me. You must be tired from your journey. Sifu, your family are here. Shall I bring you all some tea? Yes, yes, straight away. Daishé. How are you? I'm so hot. Your disciple was wasting our time outside. I, uh... Never mind, never mind. You're here now. Come to my office. It's cooler in there. Wait. You remember Sunny, right? Ah, Sunny. You're so grown up. You were only up to my waist when you learned Kung Fu with me. Now you're going to run the restaurant? I'm excited and nervous. 
I have so much to learn, Sumzook. Sifu. Everyone calls me Sifu here. Have you forgotten? Even Guma? Eh. Show some respect for your elders. I remember, Sifu. Good, good. And what are your plans? Consult family first. Guma was bringing me... Never mind. Guma and I will chat. Daishé, let's go and have some tea. Can I join you? Leave the serious discussions to the adults. Wow, what a great family we have in this game. I'm an adult too. Then show us. It must be earned. Uh, Sifu? Yes, Sunny. Practice Kung Fu? <laughs> do you want me to practice Kung Fu? I don't want you to do anything. Then should I wait out here for Guma? You need to take action for yourself. To move a mountain, one begins by carrying away small stones. My students will help you. I'm not sure... I'm not sure how I can show you that I'm ready for this. Take action. Like your parents, we won't be he always here to help guide you. Wow. Are we continually referring to the fact that my parents maybe are dead? Good, good. The journey of a thousand miles begins with one step. You can join my disciples. Try and learn something, eh? Huh. Am I student one? Because they're two, three, four. Hello? Greetings. My name's Sunny. I am Awa. You can call me Sister Wa. Who is the lady with you? Sifu's sister. And you're his niece? Yes. I thought as much. How long have you studied under Sifu? Oh, I'm the newest here. Just a few months. Sifu's been very patient with this beginner. Do you come and train every day? My family live very far away, so I actually live here now. It's my new home. Wow. Is Sifu always so serious? Oh no, he's kind and funny too, but only shows it when we're not practicing. Are you practicing Chaogar? Yes, it's from the Southern Shaolin Monastery. Is that the praying mantis style? Yes, we're practicing the first form. Do you want to see it? Yes, please. Can you teach me? Sorry, no, I can't. Not even a bit? No, it is not allowed. Why not? We need to be properly qualified to teach. Maybe if Sifu asked me, I could. Sifu sent me to train with you. Maybe I could help you after you learn from all the others. Thank you. Sure. Hmm. Who are you? I'm Sunny. I'm Kwong. What do you want? Sifu sent me. Sifu said I should practice with you, but I'm not sure I remember the form. Standing around isn't going to help. I want to learn Chaogar. Can you teach me? There are strict there are there are strict processes. You are not my disciple. Could you show me? Just watch us practice then. But do you have any tips? Here's a tip, stop bothering me. In that case, I'll just tell Sifu that you won't practice together. Okay, okay, let's start again. Tell me your problem. Maybe there's some way I can help. So, Sifu sent me a, a task. I'm not sure I can fulfill it, but I think learning and practicing some form will help. Sifu values hard work and dedication.
I understand, and I'm serious. I would like to know Sif- I would like to show Sifu that I'm serious. That's why I want to learn some form from you. Is that reason enough for you? I think Sifu sent you to test my patience. Alright, I'll show you. Let's- let's work on the out-breath. Are you paying attention? Yes! Good. Breathe out as you expand your- your frame. Use the breath to release all energy within you. Out-breath is expansion. Okay, good. I have to practice, and so do you. I will. Good. About Sifu. You seem very young to be so experienced. Like Sifu, I try to be focused and determined. You must be his favorite student. Sifu doesn't have favorites. He treats us all equally. Why do you gossip about Sifu? He's so private. I'm not sure how else I can learn more about him. If you want to learn, if you want to know more about Sifu, ask Sifu. Thanks. Goodbye. These are, there's a mixed batch of kindness here. One polite person and three rude people so far. All right. Well, this is the road to Guangdong. If you want to find out how where this goes, story-wise, and see more of the nice, pretty. Very colorful visuals. Uh, there's a link to the Steam page in the description. Yeah, it's got an up upcoming release date in June, I believe, is the current uh, path. But, you know, indie games, they can fluctuate a bit. Uh, so it'll be out when it's out. Uh, thank you to the developer for sending me a code so I could preview their game. Thanks for watching, like always, guys. And I'll see you next time.